Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your6 Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to go and show you how to remove the faceplate right here on your PlayStation 5 controller. So let's go ahead and jump in the video right now. So it's relatively easy to remove this faceplate if you want to go ahead and spray paint it and get a different color. Now I'm just using this tool that I got with one of my kits with a bunch of screwdrivers off of Amazon. And this is just called the Techman kit. Great tools for your life and work. And it has a bunch of tools that makes taking apart controllers really easy. So you don't necessarily need this, but you just need something to get under the face plate right here. So I'm gonna start with this edge and then I'm gonna use this tool and just push it under here. And this will pop off real easily. Then do the same thing for the other side. Right here and pop it off. And then if it didn't already pop off in this area, just go ahead and go on along the edge here and just lift up. Now the hardest part, if you took this off like the first time, the areas right between your touchpad, they may get a little bit stuck. So you may need some effort just to lift those up. But you shouldn't break your controller if you lift them up. So just go slow and maybe pull it towards you as you lift up. So just go like this and it should come off. So this is what your controller will now look like. So if you want to go ahead and spray paint this, I would probably do like a blue or a glossy finish. That would look really cool. Now to get it on again, you first want to put these little edges right near the touch pad. And you can see the little holes right here on the sides. You want to place this in those little holes first before you put lace this on. So just like this, and they may kind of get stuck. So let's place this on over my thumbsticks. You can see they're in. Then just snap it back down on the sides here. And this is looking good. And it is sitting flat. So that is how you would remove it and then place it back on. Snap it in, push it up. So hopefully this quick little tutorial did indeed help you guys out. If it did, go and leave a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more tech help videos coming up next on Your Six Studios.